These trailer lights are amazing. They come in a fully encased metal frame which will protect the lights from rocks and other things that get flipped into the trailer while driving. I also like the fact the metal comes bare so I was able to paint them to match my trailer. All in all this is a great set of lights, and the price is right on the money for all you get. These lights and housings worked out great. I bolted them on in place of a worn out set. I didn't weld up the gaps. I painted them in and out with bedliner paint, wired them up, and they worked great. Make sure you have a good ground or they will work erratically. These are strong, well made and fit my needs perfect. I welded them to the bumper of a camper that had bad electrical problems. For those who have asked, these are truck lights with a 3 wire pigtail FPR the 6 inch oval and a 2 wire pigtail for the side marker. The red wire is stop turn signal, back is running clearance lights, and white is ground. So on a flat 4 wire harness, green and yellow go to red on respective sides, brown goes to the black, and white goes to the frame. I added a white plate light to the top by drilling 3 holes, and connecting the black wire to the brown harness wire the grommets for the 6 inch lights are very tight. Using WD-40 on the edge of the light helps a lot when pushing the light into the grommet and will not harm a thing. My property is on a steep slope, and it took no time for the lowly mounted plastic lights on my caravan trailer to get knocked out. These boxes installed easy after drilling some fresh holes in the boxes. Wire them up securely. The seals around the lights are pretty tough to get in, you just have to work it a little bit at a time and you'll get there. Construction seems solid. I bet these survive many more unintentional collisions with the ground.